And this is what it feels like. And this is what it feels like. And I survive cause it's special first You get successful, then it get stressful thirst Go test, you see what your texture's worth Diamonds and pipes, one of them pressure burst Street still like Yo, 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 what up, what up, what up It's the we Maryland for back. Crypto Show We back in the building, yes. welcome, Coming welcome to episode 2 Episode 2, episode yeah, 2, you know. welcome, welcome Blessed to be here, you know, mm-hmm. with family and Brethren, you know, it's all love in the building, Maryland for Crypto Show. That's how we do. Yep, we're yep. bringing it to you live and direct every Glad Tuesday to from Studio 202. And we're showing you everything there is to know about crypto. Because crypto is a new hustle in 2021. Yes, we're stamping that right here from on the Maryland for Crypto Show. You, you know, know what that's what it is. It's your boy Sean Prince in the building. Um, you know, I, I, I'm really vibing with our intro track right now, man. I'm loving that. That Nipsey Hustle vibe, you know, oh, he's yeah. a visionary. Shout he's a hustle. Nipsey. Rest in peace, Nipsey. You know, he kind of paved. I won't say he paved the way, but his his uh the way he looked at things and the way he perceived things. You know, he was ahead of his time. He's very forward thinking. Yeah, and, um, definitely, definitely. And Nipsey, I feel like Nipsey, that. Uh, I think Nipsey would definitely approve of what's going on right here. Oh, exactly, yeah. exactly. As he should, because it's One three the kings in the us. building. Mm-hmm. Three kings in the building. Nipsey would definitely approve the three wise men in your building. You know, it's your boy Sean Prince. I'm gonna go ahead and throw it to my brethren. You know, let's let the people know who we are, man. Let's yeah. let the people know who we are. Well, I mean, you know, I'm your boy Money Meach. Um, I mean, a little bit about myself. Who am I, man? Money meets in the building. <laughs> bro, I'm right. just I'm just another brother trying to make it through this pandemic, man. That's, that's amen. Right. Amen to right. that, bro. That's, 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 that's all, bro. Like you know, I'm I. I mean, I went to Bowie State. Um, okay. I got my graduate. I, I'm I got my bachelor's in communications, broadcast journalism. Uh, I've I, been doing some homework. I got I got some certifications. I'm certified. Okay. Oh, you uh, cert- certified. Certified. Yeah, I got the certs- in, you know, certified. Bitcoin and blockchain essentials through uh, the IBM Academy. Um, mm, okay. Blockchain certified in the building. So y'all know everything you hear in this in on this podcast blockchain is official certified. tissue. Little you know, a little something, a little certification. Slack, you know, but yeah, something man, slack. You know, I'm just trying to uh, I'm just trying to find my way, man. Find my way in this world, just like everybody else. You right. know, it's not mm-hmm. too much, but you know. Just trying to make a shake, man. What's going on with you, LJ? <laughs> hey, I mean, building off those blockchain certs. Hey, let's go. We already know. Oh, so we got two blockchain yeah, certifiers. Yeah, you know what I mean? Hey, okay. to talk about it, you got to be about it, baby. Okay. You know okay. Got that Bitcoin yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to catch up. I'm feeling you know left out. It's all good, though. Got that blockchain I read a lot. <laughs> Assert, you feel me? I read a little bit. That's about. I mean, but we've had these for a minute, though. I mean, we've just been part of our research. I mean, when you're doing your research, you got to do the things that you need to do to, you know, I mean, move forward and getting those certifications was was a big part of that. Mm -hmm. Um, Also, too, I have my um, degree um, in business administration, and currently, right now, midway through my master's program. Hopefully, I graduate in December if um, things keep. Going right. I mean, okay, masters in the you know building. So, and, it's in, and it's in finance too. Like I said, man, I'm always aiming for that CPA, trying to be your financial advisor one day. Y'all might need me. You know what I mean? It is. <laughs> but that's about it, it man. I mean, uh, we ain't gonna glow too much. But I mean, like I said, but once again, these things were things we needed to do to better ourselves and make sure our knowledge was up to par to do what we got to do. Right, because this space is brand new, and um, brand we kind of learn as we go, and we learn on an everyday basis. Definitely. It's uh, nonstop. Yeah, yeah there's no there's no changing. classes for this. Like there's no there's no true college classes, no high school classes. Literally you have to find these and go in a deep hole and find these certs and, and, and get certified and pass a class and all that. So yeah, but once you do it, hey, you feel like a better person and you know what you're talking about. You're yeah. able to relay that information mm-hmm. to that next absolutely. person. You, you can make it make sense to yourself. Yeah. Absolutely. It's all about doing your diligence. Absolutely, absolutely. Because cryptocurrency is, you know, it's an ever changing space. It's um, always evolving. There's always yeah, something day. happening every day. Mm-hmm. There's there's news. There's there's big things. And um, let's get right into that, man. Let's uh, what's some hot takes that's happening this week? You know, or this past week that just happened. Some current events in the space. Um, you know, I personally know that there's been a lot going on this week. Uh, a couple of all time highs with some high favorite coins. Yes, sir. We got a lot of major institutions that's mm-hmm. jumping on board. Yes, sir. Um, I'm kind of feeling adoption at this point. I'm feeling like a mainstream adoption is almost imminent. It's it's right. coming. It's, yeah, it's inevitable. I, I mean, as, as I mean, once again, once 
you start seeing stars and rappers and 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 mainstream people coming into this space mm-hmm. adoption will be coming mm-hmm. you know what I mean? corporations the hype yeah. is there the hype yeah. is there yeah. the hype is there. the hype is real people but but also when you start seeing all those people come in you 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 might the, the, be a little yeah, too you, late. You, you like, starting is you know just just your time slot to mm-hmm. I guess you know honestly for what we're trying to bring awareness to mm-hmm. you know, your time slot is starting to slip away right. because you know those major institutions are you know starting yeah they're to starting to adopt it they're in, coming on board yep. Yep. yep definitely and it's yeah you know it's kind of like a a wave effect um you know. We all know Elon Musk. Whenever he speaks, the people listen. So, right. <laughs> if yeah, he yeah. advocates for for Dogecoin, we're gonna have a million uh, meme coiners trying to jump on and coin and jump onto a coin with cents. no utility right. or <laughs> no basis. People, you know, pile. people. You heard it first on the Maryland for Crypto show. Yeah. You need to invest in coins that have utility. utility. Coins that have real world practical. Yeah. Um, practical blockchains yeah, that solve, solve worldly issue. issues. Mm-hmm. Solve it. We want something that's going to solve the issue. If, if it's not solving nothing, what are we, what are we doing? Like in this te- in this technology in this world today, people are hurting. We need things to solve problems, solve issues. Like things has to get done now. Like we're there's tired a lot of, of problems. waiting. Yeah, there's a lot of problems. We're tired of waiting for the government's handouts and and people like no, we mm-hmm. have to do it ourselves. We have you know what I mean, technology that can help us move to do those things. So let's not let's not. Absolutely, and um, you know, we kind of touch bases on is out there. a lot of these um, these talking points on our first episode. So definitely, if you guys missed the first episode, go check it out. Um, yeah, we touch bases on uh, you know definitely exchanges that you need to go buy your um, your coins on the different types of coins that are in the arena. Some of the major coins that you guys need to be on the radar XRP. for. You know, so definitely Bitcoin. go check out the first episode if you're Ethereum. trying to, because we we're telling a story here on the Melvin Crypto Show. We're not just bringing you random um, takes on what's happening. We yeah. we're giving it from the ground up. We're gonna build your foundation, and every we're gonna week, take you to the next we're level. We're telling you what we doing every week. Right. We we, right. we living this story with you. Hey, we all going through it right now. Trust me, this Absolutely. is real life in the flesh. I right promise here. you, you're not like you know. As you learn, we are learning too. Yeah, like when Absolutely. we teach, when we teach, we're learning. That's right. the best way to learn. You we are crypto teachers. We're not your advisors, but we're crypto teachers. Yeah, definitely not we're financial done. advisors. We're, definitely won't throw that out there. But we be teachers. Though, we dabble in the space. We do our research, and we've all personally seen gains in this space in a short period of time. Yes. So we're just trying to bring awareness so that everybody else is able to attain those gains that we have received. So if, if we win, everybody wins. If I right. win, you win. We win. That's how we gonna roll. Um, yes. But yeah, just some things that's happened during the week. Uh, the Federal Reserve payment system crashed for several hours. So we're talking about the centralized system that we're all used to. Um, you know, that definitely crashed for out. And I think that outage, you know, amongst other things like the short that happened with GameStop and AMC, I think those different um, those different uh, uh, and, and things that happen in, in our space, it, it kind of sends people to crypto because you see the centralized um, system that we're all used to is flawed right now. Right. And it's a lot of glitches, a lot of things that happen, and we see that it's controlled by a certain entity. The difference between cryptocurrency is that it's not controlled by anyone. You know, it's not one governing party over this space. This place is completely transparent. Yeah, definitely. And it's open it's 24 7. Validators. Doesn't close on Fridays. You could come in on the weekends. And um, just some hot coins that I personally think have taken off for the last week. I got to throw in Cardano. Yeah. ADA this yeah. is definitely a coin that we here in the Maryland for Crypto oh, yeah. show yeah, yeah. we advocate for Cardano reach an all time high of a dollar forty nine this week forty nine yes. I want to say what people what's the rate of return <laughs> Cardano about sixty times rate of return right now for right. the year somewhere in that range it's like yeah something crazy it's like three hundred. So I mean, three thousand percent. Something crazy. It's, you know, from the from the from the beginning of the year of the crash since now it's up percentages of percentages of percentages. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let me just say that. I mean, uh, it, it changes. It changes because I mean, all granted, it just dipped. You know what I mean? But we fighting back. It was at one forty, dropped back down to like one twenty four. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, currently I think it's sitting about today. Currently, it's sitting at about one nineteen. Yeah, one nineteen. So like I mean, yeah, those percentages does change. But once again, people are up. Yeah, yeah, and 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 Card I know is making moves. So Absolutely. you know, while they just had this, you know, nice little pump. And then you know you know okay so we just reached the new all time high, uh, one dollar and forty nine cents. Dollar forty nine cents, absolutely. Uh, again, now just, now just it, it, you said what? No, I'm just saying. Just imagine you bought it at two cents. Oh oh man, man. Look, listen listen listen. I, I wish I would have. I wish I could have got into this project at two cents. 
You know, however, you know, I, I, I still got in, I feel like, at a decent oh, yeah, price. Yeah, you you know, I got in at around, what, 30 cent? Um, so, um, but what I was saying was, you know, um, with those, you know, it, it just uh, it just went up. It, it, it dipped back down a little bit, um, you know, but they're still making major moves. Right. Yeah, big time moves. They have a lot of partnerships yeah. going on. Yeah. Um, I know um, big partners I know, uh, coming out. I know you know Sean been hitting me Bangers. up all week. He been you know telling me yeah. you know like yo, yo Cardano did this, they, they did that. You know he, uh, <laughs> he got he. I know he 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 heavy packed on information with Cardano right yeah, now. Yeah, definitely. Right? Uh, just to For drop sure. something on y'all, um, FD Seven Ventures um, owner Prakash Chan. He sees Cardano as long term polka dot and Ethereum beaters, and that they're all gonna be world changing magnitude investments um hmm. he's and he actually he's sold like, oh. they, he was selling 750 million dollars of his bitcoin yeah, really to invest in cardano polka dot and ada so right. i mean that's that's huge that's huge for a fd7 ventures fund to you know drop that type of um, capital and sell his bitcoin so what that tells me is that bitcoin may be you know, a thing of the past. You know, we got a lot of you know st- generation three nah, coins that are coming that out there. Go away. It's too many people and invested, but yeah, it's some old technology. Yeah, there's some old technology. It's, definitely, yeah, it's, it's a little old. It's definitely old You're technology. Doing your research. Uh, is you know, it's it's what it's it's decentralized yeah. for sure. You know, they they use what proof of stake. Mm-hmm. No, they use proof of work. Proof of work. They use proof of yeah. work. They wish they used yeah. proof of stake. <laughs> So um, it's it's definitely old technology. That's what the damn it's, trying to get to. It's a lot of new players in the game, but you know. You, once again, you can never go wrong with Bitcoin. Yeah, you can't. It's digital gold. Yeah. I yeah, mean, you know, I'm not, I'm not down in Bitcoin. That's what they say. And at, but, the end, know, at this at, point in time, at the end of the day, you know, each of these blockchains or each of these cryptocurrencies, they're built off the Bitcoin algorithm. Right. Yeah, absolutely. So, so, it's, it's the grandfather of yeah. the game. It's exactly. the OG. You so know, you know, got... regardless of what these altcoins do, yeah. you know, if they're going, Bitcoin is going to go with them. Right at the end of the day, they're gonna and vice, be, and vice versa. And vice versa. And vice versa. Mm-hmm. Right now, I mean, Bitcoin controls the market, anyways. What? What? Sixty nine yeah. percent of them. You know, what I mean, the market with yep. those controls. So, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I mean, the OG is always gonna be around. You know, when the OG leave and come back, guess what? He's still loved in the streets. You know what I mean? And that's what's Facts. gonna be. He gonna be loved they, in the streets. They say they they say he's a legend. Right? Yeah, they gonna be like, like, oh, my my boy <laughs> out here. You know what I'm saying? He a legend in the street. Facts. OG back. So that's what's going to happen. You know what I mean? Yep, yep. And um, just to keep it rolling with Bitcoin, man, um, some big news happened yesterday with Bitcoin. Uh, Citibank, they wrote a 100-page document. Pretty 100 much a 100-page document. You People can find it right online. Now, yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> this is like a major institution, you know, to... Man, I ain't see that. Like we, we've gone from, like, paragraphs or articles that come from on Google here and there right. to now major institutions are now reporting 100 page documents mm-hmm. on these coins and they're right. breaking it down and how they feel that uh, mass adoption mm-hmm. is imminent and that mm-hmm. I feel like that's a pretty glaring in your way face in your face way to kind of intro you know and you said that Citibank 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 yeah. yeah. okay, yeah. and, and that's the crazy thing right there like it's a 100 page document mm-hmm. who is going to read that you know, like what average person is going to sit and read a hundred pages worth of information from the bank? Right. You oh, know, look, look, LJ raised his hand. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, we got look, the research look, up in this, there. Listen, the average person is not going to read that. That's a fact. Like, you know, I'm. But you, man, for crypto, I'm, I'm, I'm we just, above average. I'm just deep diving. Diving. Look, Looking at like, <laughs> look, what's that say? Oh, and okay. it's crazy because you know, I'm, I'm just hearing this information for the first time right here. Right. Guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go home and, and read look into it. it. I'm gonna read about it. Look, look. I got And if I anything, I know, if it, I wanna know. it means you read the first fifty. I got the last. That's a thing. We'll, we, just, we, we'll bring we, it together. We, do it like we that. make it happen. <laughs> we'll make it happen. We definitely make that happen. That's, That's how you I gotta would, do it, I'm man. Gonna it. I'm gonna have it. Have I'm Siri read to me. Right. <laughs> <laughs> just sit back, like. True, right. Siri. That makes sense. Right. So, um, yeah, let's let's keep it rolling, man. Besides, you know, big. I mean, Bitcoin's always gonna have news. Every week, we we're gonna hear something related to Bitcoin. But mm-hmm. how about you know? I like to always, you know, touch basis on what's happening in the community. And um, a lot of people I see are wearing a frenzy in the, the past week or so about the recent retracement oh, yeah. that took place in the market. Oh, we yeah. saw a sea of red <laughs> right. for yeah. over out here bloody out here. about two weeks now, roughly, yeah, in that definitely, range. Yeah. Definitely. And I mean, yeah. major this is, retracements this on is a the lot of different time. Colors. This is when we buy those. Right. When it's blood in the streets, you buy. Yeah, man. Like, you buy. Like, like this is yes. like, oh, the, op- the market is opposite. Red means go. Right. 
Yeah. Green means stop. Stop. Right. Stop and watch. You know. Hit them brakes. You know, if you yeah. if you need to make a sale. Mm-hmm. You know, right. But you know, red means go. Right. Red means red means. That's why it's important when it's green. It's important to get your coins in line. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, have them prepared. Have it set aside. Like you know, okay, you got your bills. Mm-hmm. You got your groceries. Mm-hmm. You know, okay, have some some money set aside. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do with this money. Yeah. I'm just waiting for the right opportunity. That market hits that retracement, it goes red. You get in, you yeah, get in the game. On the side, folks you get ready. in the game, and then that's mm-hmm. that's and then that that stops you from that stops you from honestly crushing your own hopes mm-hmm. because when you jump in when it's green, it can easily retrace whenever. Mm-hmm. So if you are somebody new who's coming into the space and you jump into the market while it's green and rising, and then it straight stops, you're gonna get discouraged because you just put your money in and now you've seen it lose right absolutely it's all about your dollar cost averages people like buying the red holding the green and just ride the wave but now i will say this the crypto space is definitely very volatile right. compared to other spaces definitely. so you're going to see big ups and you're going to see big downs yeah you got to be but um what, one thing I, what, if you are not prepared to talk to take, him, uh 30 percent yeah talk retrace- to let him know talk to if him if you're Meech. not if you're not prepared to take a 30 percent retracement or in other words a 30 percent loss then mm-hmm. you don't deserve 100% gains. Tell them again it, one more time. I don't think they don't heard me on that one, man. If you don't are not prepared it. to take a 30% loss, mm-hmm. you do not deserve 100% gains. Damn. 200% gains. This you don't this. deserve it. You got to have and 200 per game. 200 percent games is something that happens on the regular in mm-hmm. this space. Let's let that it, let's it, put that out there. I, well, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's not it doesn't it's, it's not a regular thing. Like what's happening right now in the market is not regular this is a so what's correction. happening in the market this is a right period now. right yeah, like, correction you know, well we, okay we talked about cycles like, we talked about this on the last show a little bit we didn't really dive into it um but you know we're in the middle of a halving which okay. uh which okay. is basically the splitting of bitcoin okay and um okay. this happens every four years or so you know um it, market. you know i think yeah. what like once they give out about what like two thousand something um two hundred thousand uh bitcoin blocks Mm-hmm. They they split it in half again, and that right. and that and that two hundred thousand blocks that's given out it happens what like every four years yeah, every four years yeah so yeah this is this is a period that it, it will end and you, yeah. you know the yeah, market won't all be, the way up the won't forever. it won't be as yeah it's not it's not gonna be as super volatile as as it is mm-hmm. right now right. you know next year or maybe in another year or two right. mm-hmm. but it, it's gonna it's gonna cycle back around yeah. yep. and you know once you do your research mm-hmm. you you'll know these things. Absolutely. And you'll be able to stay and, ahead of the game. And, and you'll be able to buy in those red super massive and real fast, the 90% retracements. Yeah, and just be able to buy. And just real fast and too, wait. just adding on to that. With these retracements coming in in the future, I mean with more institutions and things coming in and more money into this to this space, those those corrections are going to be less volatile. I mean, yeah. once again, mm-hmm. you got to understand the the Facts. stock market Facts. moves so small. You see so much because why? There's so much around. money. They're not going to let a big thirty percent thirty percent mean people are jumping off buildings in the regular stock market. I'm trying to tell you, if it was to drop 30, 40%, people are jumping off buildings, people are crying, people are millionaires. Paper hands is yeah. what it sounds like to me. <laughs> but, but in the crypto market, you can have that. So once again, but once again, when that market and these institutions and things come in, that, that volatile, that, that, you know what I mean, that's hard, that hard uh, drop, mm-hmm. we won't have that no more. We'll, we'll, it'll, it'll correct itself. It, we'll still have a drop, but it won't be Eighty percent. It won't be sixty percent. We'll get more of like a forty, thirty-five percent drop, correcting, and then as we move on years from now, yeah, definitely right. by two thousand thirty. I mean, crypto market is gonna be washed out. It's like so. This is the time to get the money. It's the time to get it. This now. is the time to get the money. It's not gonna be here forever. Yeah, right. Because we're early. Right now, we still early. And we late. We yeah. late. We early, still, but we honestly, we we we. It's 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 crazy because yeah. we we are early. But we're still late. Third generation coins. Like come we on missed now. the first one and like, two. Like we know, we all know where Bitcoin was, man. We we're not gonna get into it, man. Right. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. We're on this um, third generation. You know, you know, we are definitely we practice what we preach here on the Maryland for Crypto show, and um, during this recent retracement, I personally, you know, since we buy on the dip and holding the green, I personally grabbed a good amount of V chain. 
Um, okay. Oh yeah. Okay. You went is, vet shopping. Yeah, man. I went vet shopping. <laughs> you we, went to the vet. We vet kings up here. <laughs> yeah, you went vet shopping. Yeah, man. Right, I went vet shopping, man. I like vet. Hey, man. we told them we muscled up last week. Yeah, they did. They muscled up on me last week, man. They, <laughs> you went they, you know, they, because you know they've been in the V chain game for for a little longer than I have, but it's cool, man. You know, I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna but, get there. But this was the best time to do it. Though, Absolutely. Again, yeah. Drop from what five cents to three cents. Three cents. Yeah. So yep. I yep. mean, this is the best time to clean up. Mm-hmm. Hey, I mean, definitely. I don't know what your bag looked like, but if you dropped a nice little bag, you cleaned up. Indeed. I mean, it's, like it was, it was, it was sitting at three cent. It, it, right. it, uh, it went to what, like point zero three five. Now, right. I think that was might have been the lowest retrace. Right. It's back at four zero four five. Right. Right now, um, you know, I'm I'm looking. I mean, so it's for, slowly coming up. Yeah, I'm looking for yeah. BJ to, you know, spike in the near future. Not nothing crazy. Not a crazy crazy spike, but I, you know, just yeah. a little something to. Make me feel good. About feel myself. good about the project. Feel <laughs> right, good about right. that supply Everything chain yeah. block. Supply chain management blockchain. Right. You know? Yeah, for sure. For but sure. um, definitely, yo, thanks. Thank you guys. You know, for tuning in. You know, it's us three in the building, Maryland for crypto show. And uh, like I said, we we men of our word over here. We practice what we preach. And um, if you watched our last episode, you saw at the end of the episode, we kind of threw it out there. We gave it to the people. We said. You know, if anybody got any questions we wanted all that or smoke. they feel like, you know, what we're talking about in here isn't necessarily legit, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know, come on the show. You know, let's hear let's hear your, your opinion. Let's hear where Test. you're coming from. Yo. So, you know, that's what happened, like, man. So one of our um, one of our viewers definitely reached out to us and wanted to <laughs> offer her insight on what's happening in, in the space right now. And right. so when we come back from commercial break, we, we're going to bring to you our special guest, we'll Joyce Bomja. She's a nurse practitioner, you know, on the front lines of the coronavirus. Oh, we got and, a nurse practitioner in the We got a nurse practitioner in the building, okay, you know, power, first episode, no, second episode, excuse me. So, yeah, we're going uh, we're gonna to cut to her when we get back. And, uh, you know, thank you for tuning in to the Maryland for Crypto Show. We'll be back at you in a second. We Quick coming back, break. folks. Quick commercial breaks. Welcome, 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 welcome back to the Maryland for Crypto show. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. sir. We in the building. We in the All building. Day. It's your boy Sean Prince. You know, I'm out here with my guy Money Meach. I'm out here with my guy LJ. Mm-hmm. Right we now. have our Squad. first guest for the Maryland for Crypto show. If I, let me get. I got to give our first guest. Yeah, a first round of applause. Man. <laughs> yeah, give her a round yes, of applause. Yes, sir. Give it. Yes. Yeah, round that's applause. That's, yes, that's, that's sir, crazy, man. man. <laughs> Thank you for coming to the building. Hey, you appreciate know. you. Called us on our bluff. We wasn't bluffing. I was yeah, man. We, like I said, we put it out there, and you know, she said she wanted to come and get some more info on the space, and so heard us talking you know, that's about what that. We, that's what we came to do. So, um, yeah. So uh, let's introduce yourself to the people, Joyce. You know, tell them a little bit about yourself, a little about your background, you know, career, things of that nature. You know, the floor is yours. All right. Um, so my name is Joyce, and I'm currently a nurse practitioner in Virginia. Um, I'm very excited to be here. And nice, I nice. Yeah, excited, yeah. Excited, yeah. Excited, yeah. 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 Um, Let's go. I wanted to come and talk about my two passions. Basically, I'm interested in medicine and money. Nice. Um, Medicine and money, double M, double M, shorty, double M, double M, shorty. Up until not too long ago, I've been more interested in spending money than saving it, and so oh, now I've I think been, we've all felt that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, in the recession, how huh? you spending out here spending? You shining in the recession. Well, so. She's on the front lines. Yeah, she deserves to, <laughs> she to <laughs> splurge a little bit. Hey, the you hospital know? never went down. Right, how exactly. Yeah. Essential <laughs> worker. <laughs> Essential <laughs> worker. Right. She's right. getting right. that big right. bread. That <laughs> good overtime. So, um, so lately, I've been spending more time in. Um, I guess just investing in my retirement, putting putting money towards my um, employer match okay. retirement. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. I've got some real estate out in California. Nice, yes. Cali, yeah. Cali, LA, love Cali, Cali in the California. house. Give me big shout outs yes, to Cali. Sir. Big shout outs to Cali. Yes. Yeah, you know I love Cali. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love Boy, Cali. nips. 
and just recently learned about cryptocurrency. And um, I guess one of the biggest ones I have is VeChain. I've got almost ten thousand. Oh, you a vet wow, girl too? She's a okay. vet, a vet queen. We got vet kings and queens <laughs> okay. in the building. It's the, well, it's the royal castle. Real fast, real fast. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Moving I'll forward, we that. don't tell nobody how much our bag is. Oh, right? sure. Just right. say I got a nice bag. That's what we do. Hey, man, she says she on the front lines. <laughs> yeah, there, bro. Right. Like, right. 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 You right. never exposed the bag. You feel me? The bag never gets exposed. So let me just say I got. Oh, yeah. Nurse right. practitioner yeah, in the nice building. Sure. Okay. All right. All right. So yeah. So but she's stacking, folks. So you about so how do you um so I know you said you're in the medical field mm-hmm. and um I know personally V Chain definitely it, it correlates with the medical field in a mm-hmm. sense um mm-hmm. the the coin itself you know being supply chain management and blockchain management also matter of fact you know what I'm, let me before I get ahead of myself let me you know for for all our viewers that's out here I just want to drop a little bit of what VeChain is so that you guys understand what we're talking about right, VeChain definitely. essentially it tracks the process of creation shipment and storage of any commercial item or product mm-hmm. so this information is stored on VeChain's blockchain and it can be accessed online using you know a specific uh, QR code and it's useful information such as previous locations, sell by dates, yeah. um, and those are all used in the in the QR code. And mm-hmm. and it, the VeChain blockchain is also tamper proof, mm-hmm. and um, it could right. be used to verify designer items. It could mm-hmm. be used to verify shoes. Just mm-hmm. for instance, Nike just signed a contract with VeChain to authenticate their shoes. So that's okay. some of the major moves that's happening. Yes. The and check not, is out here. The check is out here. And there's a lot of things going <laughs> on in Checks over V-Chain stripes. Right you now. already know what it is. And, um, Shout you out know, to my boy Shoes. Speaking of designer, you know, uh, the company's owner or the CIO is Mr. Sonny Lou, Mr. Louis V. He he was mm-hmm. the CIO of Louis Vuitton. Mm-hmm. So just so you know, you know, you, yeah. you're dealing with heavy hitters in this yeah. V-Chain arena. And, definitely. Um, I Mr. Definitely Louis Vuitton. Coin. Definitely. See, we trying to help y'all ladies. All y'all bags that's free. I mean, they getting scalped. <laughs> hey, we trying to make sure your stuff is yeah, official. Man. Facts, facts, but facts. But just to, um, you know, keep it rolling and touch bases. You know, I know V-Chain has a lot of uses, and it definitely could, um, you know, be useful in the medical field. What are some issues that you see in the medical field right now that you feel like, you know, something that you think could be improved upon or things of that nature? So I think one of them you kind of covered with the security. So okay, that security. would be okay. nice when it comes to patient information. Yeah. Okay. Um, but HIPAA. Yes. Yeah, okay. But one of the biggest problems I face is getting the documentation that we need in a timely manner. Okay. Um, because people get care Medical at record? all sorts of, yeah. Okay. Um, so if you get care at one place and then you go somewhere else, then um, if they don't communicate, it takes a while takes to get a, all yeah, the right, information right. over. Right. Um, Which is important. And depending on where you work, you might need it right away, like in the emergency department or in the okay. ICU. Mm-hmm. Right, because medical so. emergencies, uh, mm-hmm. you know, yeah, yeah. There's, yeah. No, there's no timetable yeah. on that. Nah, you need it's, it. it's, a, it's about efficiency. It's, it's about speed. Right. It's, and, um, yeah. Speaking from experience, I mean, I did work at you know, I mean, University of Maryland, Shock Trauma. Okay. Shout out to them. And, Shout out uh, to Shock Trauma. You, yeah, John Hopkins as well as an anesthesia tech. So, oh, boy. Oh, boy. Here we go. I'm just I'm relating. I'm just saying. I feel her pain because once right. again I'm her tech so I'm the one that gotta go He's find this the one this. bringing the <laughs> yeah, if I can't her. find it she yelling at me <laughs> right <laughs> I'm just trying to I, I feel you, you know on me? That. so I've been right, there right, right, I know right. what it is I feel you, you on know, that we checking right. wristbands we making sure we verifying that's how we do Maryland right. so, crypto so you, show, man. so you the one that get cussed out yeah I'm the one that's <laughs> in the, I'm really in the front line she in the office until I knock on the door like he's ready for you you know so these are the problems that we have these issues ladies and gentlemen so yeah, um, V Chain will solve all that. I mean, being able to uh, actually verify it on the blockchain, meaning once it hits that blockchain, it, you can't change it. You can't alter that information. So once we the, that information um, having medical records put on that blockchain, it doesn't matter what hospital I go to. It doesn't matter what ER, what uh, private sector, what uh, I don't know any other medical place and when I get there I'm able to show my medical records that it's been verified it's on the blockchain and these have not been altered and they'll be able to verify too and once then they'll take that information which will be big because once again if I go to a doctor at John Hopkins and now I'm on vacation I'm in Mexico and I'm like oh I just scraped my leg or something I got an infection now they need to know what they need to give me you feel me so mm-hmm. If I can just show them my phone, my medical records, this is what I, and they know these are authentic, I didn't fudge it, fudge it or nothing like that, and I'm able to get that medical care I need at that point in that moment, which is big. When you're at a country, overseas, at a different hospital, whatever, you just want to make sure you're able to get that care at that moment. 
And I think that's big. I think it's important. I mean, yeah, definitely. Sure. Especially you change, solving um, that issue is 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 amazing. It's big. Especially with um, I think with the uh, coronavirus pandemic that's happened. Um, you know, c word travel. Yeah, we said c word. Definitely don't get going us put to off be. Already. Um, <laughs> it's going to be affected in a big way um, with travel and um, I. Some things that I saw on V Chain's, um, you know, personal protocol is that they're uh, kind of indoctrinating uh, e certificates for vaccines. So it's e certifications right. that are kind of um, cross border transparent to where you can e certify and you know whether you got your vaccine in the United States, you can now travel to London, you can travel right. to Egypt, you yep. can travel to India, China. You know, mm-hmm. with these e certifications, apps that, on your phone, baby. That um, you know, V Chain's technology is bringing, and I feel like that's huge. Um, not only you know, supply chain management and verifications, but being, I mean, because I love to travel. Now, whether I'm or not, I'm take the vaccines. Another story for another day. But <laughs> in the same token, <laughs> right. you know, this is what's going to be needed for the future. And um, V Chain is ahead of the game. You know, with having this technology already ready, you right. know, for you know what's happening and what's about to go down. Yeah, so they're, um, they're miles ahead of people, man. It's yeah, crazy definitely. How, how more advanced they are technology-wise. Um, just they have all the kinks pretty much out, and they're onboarding people left and right. Absolutely. I mean, yeah, honestly, oh, man, they got, yeah, let's talk about some of their partnerships, man. Uh, I mean, sh- they got a lot of partners going on right now. Like they're with uh, PwC, okay, you know, which is one of the uh, big four auditors of you know the worldwide you know worldwide um there were clients like dell okay. ford, uh, ford wow. cisco cisco okay. ibm wow. you know okay. they're talking they, about major oh, hitters yeah, right? yeah, they, bro they major corporations pwc audits over three quarters of the sp500 companies okay, okay. so they're they're so they see, big business. business they audit yeah. majority of the sp500 companies right okay. like okay for real um you got you got uh DNVGL, which is also a big audit and certification company okay. uh, worldwide. They're the biggest certified company, uh, you know, working with um, large vessels of offshore structures and right. stuff like that. Right, uh, right, right. You right. got you got Walmart of China. Wow. Uh, yeah. You know, you know, Wal- everybody knows yes. Walmart is Sam's the, Club of yeah, China. Yeah. Largest largest grocery retailer Retail. in the in u.s the, in the uh, world pretty much in you the got, world wow yeah, you, got, you know walmart's big you got baby. h&m which is the top one of the top five largest uh global company uh, um clothing retail wow. stores because yeah. h&m um, is big outside yeah. of the united states so. you got bmw wow. um you know they uh, bmw wow. yep yeah, bmw yeah, yeah, yeah. um v chain they um what they have a uh, so bmw has a, a garage start program okay mm-hmm. and um bmw i mean a v chain they partnered with them and they started and successfully completed the full program and you know they look forward to doing business with v-chain when they become mainstream right um tracking all the parts again we're just you know we're just slightly ahead of the curve like they're already using this product this technology in you know asian in the asian countries yeah speaking of that in the asian country v-chain is you know we all know how strict china is right right? and um you know v-chain is one of two blockchain one of the only two blockchains that's accepted by the chinese government right so that in itself i mean that that governmental adoption that institutional adoption i feel like that's huge for the v-chain project they're also affiliated like like you know like we were saying they're affiliated with hotels they're affiliated with hospitals yeah. um the chinese government mm-hmm. you know um v chain was also mentioned as a token of choice to help build the uh clubhouse app we all, i think we're all familiar with clubhouse yeah, it, yeah. um they're yeah, one of the I cheapest and fastest blockchain why yeah, wouldn't they exactly I mean, so i mean the type of partnerships that v chain is bringing into you know their arena into their space and they're one of the not the only but one of the only coins that can do what it does with the supply blockchain management i mm-hmm. think it has the potential to go global although it's right now it's only uh it's only um in china right so it can only Singapore, those eastern those, that eastern but i mean to industry, only be yeah. in china to have 100 plus fortune level 500 companies on board they have 50 plus real world use case projects and development right now and over a thousand plus enterprises enterprise clients coming through their pipeline yeah so i mean that's huge and not to mention you know just to bring it all back to to medicine you know being able to help certify because i want to say if joyce um did you mention about how you know the medical suppliers have their own have have each of their own technology in a way like they all like they're not inoperable am i no, correct yeah. they don't communicate with each other okay yeah. and so with v chain they will be able to communicate yeah. with each other and, right? and yeah and that's huge and not being able to communicate like i said each 
for instance, like you guys use uh, what my chart? Or? Yeah, um, Epic. Epic. So yeah. they use Epic. So for instance, um, that's just a, a platform that uh, application they use to move files and stuff and things they use it. But just for instance, they're using Epic. If you go to another another state, they might have I don't know. Sepic, I don't know, just another word, but those two things won't be able to once again connect or talk to each other. So now, I, once again, I have to go through the whole process, filling out papers. When I get there, I gotta do the whole ten minute, like, oh, I put my name, address, all this. Yeah. So once again, being able to communicate with information, in in, in medical information, technology, it's gonna it's gonna change the world, man. For sure. So, um, Joyce, I know you I know you said briefly that you know you're you're a bit new to the crypto arena, um. What I know you said you have V Chain. You know what? Um, are do you have any other coins that you possibly interested in, or why did you pick V Chain? Why V? Why was V Chain on your radar? So I do have some other ones. Um, okay. Mainly, I'm looking at their volume and then their cost. Okay. And I'm kind of a beginner, so I'm going for like the cheaper coins. And okay. More okay. Of them. Well, yeah. I mean, their total supply is like eighty six billion, so I can understand that. They have, there's a lot of coins there, mm -hmm. and I understand that. You know, I mean, it's a good market cap right now, about one what one. 1.9 billion yes market cap mm -hmm. overall right now yeah so i understand i mean that's a good cheap three three cents or four cents yeah. right now hey rack up while you can because mm -hmm. i mean of course bitcoin's out out of the reach right now you know ethereum like i said that's out of reach so once again we are in these third generation coins and v chain will be a powerhouse moving forward so yeah i mean v chain sounds like a good move to me yeah. absolutely absolutely yeah. i mean it's you know, you can't really say too much. You, you, it's almost like you, we have so many talking points on VeChain. Right. I mean, just can. the coin alone <laughs> has about 14 coins on its platform. Yeah, close um, to it. That's built on VeChain's blockchain. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Some of which are OceanX. OceanX, yeah, that's a platform. Yeah, that's yeah. an actual exchange yeah, that's that's people exchange. buy yeah. cryptocurrency from. I want to invest in that. Yeah, so yeah, that's, yeah, that's one. Um, get them all. Get them all. Yeah, right. a couple. Uh, Debet. Yeah. Yeah, uh, that's a gambling coin. So yep. yeah, it's some it's almost like casino coin. If anybody doesn't know what casino coin is, oh man, casino. Yeah, but uh, the bet, I mean, that's that's gonna be a game coin that's gonna be used for virtual gaming, um, casino. Uh, for instance, as you know right now, when you go to a casino, you can't even um, once you walk out of that casino, if you still have those chips, if you go to another casino, they don't accept those chips. But with the bet, when you have those those that physical on your phone I can go to another and change it out to it doesn't matter what casino I go to or or at the same time I can play online that's gonna be hot mm -hmm. yeah yeah man I can go to horseshoe that's and then a go game to live. yeah that's it that's, that's <laughs> and a then game hit changer. MGM all at the same time with the same blue loop, blue loop, right. blue loop. That's, hey. hey that's that's game changing stuff right there right. man for real hey definitely game changing and since we're on like casinos and gambling coins let's i got another little tidbit for you guys the governor of nevada mm -hmm. has laid out a plan to build a complete a city on blockchain a complete he, city a city oh, trying to copy blockchain. acon but i feel we need that nevada. in the united states <laughs> that's huge and i mean it's, we can't let acon outdo us this uh this project was unveiled friday and the details behind it, it allows private industry to develop technology and innovation zones that would include new cities within their own government. Okay. I mean, that's huge. That's huge. Mm -hmm. You know, adopt, that's, that's kind of just brings it all full circle to adoption. Yeah. And um, right. how, you know, things are going. And we all know VeChain is going to be a part of this bill. Yeah, it has I to. I mean, it, yeah. it's, it's if, no if question you, you about it. You can't go into the fourth industrial revolution with, in the medical field, in this supply industry. Without V chain, yeah, like I mean, if you if you are you hurting yourself. You, Why you one hundred percent hurting yourself because Why? you 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 need you need stuff to be completely tracked. Like yeah. if you you know the fourth industrial revolution is what the rise of artificial intelligence, mm -hmm. you know, absolutely. AIs, you know, yep. well, you know, um, and algorithms and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, you have to have something that can track, trace, monitor these artificial intelligence they're you know they're talking about drones amazon drones that are supposed to be dropping off our packages right. they're talking about automated truck services you right. know mm -hmm. you know no you know no more truck drivers which is gonna you know it, it's it it helps us out well it helps their companies out a lot because they save a lot of time they save a lot of money but you have to be able to track and monitor these products right you know so what is going to power these artificial intelligence what what is going to power them you tell yeah. me. Yeah. yeah, I know. Crypto, cryptocurrency. If, if there's nobody in there to actually physically give the money, and there's a robot talking to another robot, what's gonna happen there? They're gonna need some type of form of exchange. You know. Mm -hmm. what I mean? So guess what's gonna happen? 
crypto. So, I mean, it's crypto. <laughs> crypto people. Yeah, I heard it first, man. <laughs> just, just, just imagine this, though. This is the stuff I've been researching, though. Just imagine you driving down the street, right? And cars are talking to cars where maybe this car in front is going just a little too slow. But with crypto, that computer can be like, hey, I'll give you some couple dollars real fast just to move out the way so I can pass you. But guess what? That has to be done in a split second. I can't, you know what I mean, open the window and be like, yo, yo, I'm going to give you some money. Here, you move out the way. No. But <laughs> if those computers can talk to each other and, right. and, and we're cruising and I'm on, a, I'm on a time, you know what I mean, limit. Guess what? Boom, boom, send that through. Move out the way. Thank you, partner. I appreciate you. I tipped right. you. You know what I mean? I'm able to keep it moving. That's so that's the type of stuff that technology will, will bring. And you got to just open your mind to this. Like, it's, it's wild what they're trying to bring into this world. And people are not woke. Yeah. Soon, sooner or later, yeah. like I said, that first time that, that Amazon package gets delivered to your house, you're going to be like, yo, what the hell? Mm. Ain't, this, ain't this a bad? Mm. Like, that's, that's what's going to happen. Yeah. I mean, I, Honestly, they 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 slowly condition us right. with this stuff through, you know, uh, Paramounts, yeah, movies, movies. Predictive cinema programming. You know, yeah, predictive Simpsons programming. predictive programming. <laughs> the like, Simpsons has been predicting they, stuff like forever, they, man. They they prepare for all. They pre prepare us for all of this stuff through everything that they show us right. through televised programming right. for years though. This, for years. they've been they've been stowing stuff out for years, and we just now picking it up, right. It's, it's been happening. Yeah, the Front Matrix came out what two like thousand. Where do they where do they get these ideas from? Right, you know, like um, was it of Oz? <laughs> right, like, in the, you know, in the, in the back. Uh, you can call me a conspiracy <laughs> theorist. You know, you can you know that's what they that's what they want you to think. Like you know, right. they want people who are woke. Those are the people who they want to make seem crazy. Mm. But you know, this stuff is. Where do they come up with it? Yeah. Like just like you, I don't. You gotta open your mind. Yeah. Open your mind a little bit. Open and your see mind things for what they really are. Think outside the box right now. Everybody's thinking like this. Oh, money will never die. Fiat is when America is the number one in the world. Think about it, but money. guess what? Outside of this tunnel right here, things is going on. China's fast. moving fast. You know what I'm saying? Really fast. Russia's moving fast. Money over didn't here. always you know exist. I mean? Africa's moving fast. Hey, once the African comes on board. Hey, Speaking yeah. of Africa, Cardano yeah. has over a hundred projects on his black on his blockchain. Yeah, um, and it's just it's about to secure a government with a, a government contract with Africa. Hmm. So I mean, and that's um, supposed to be you know coming up here yeah. soon in March, like yeah. this month. Sometime, and so. Africa is a leapfrog country. Does anybody know that? Like, what does that mean? A leapfrog country. So one of those countries said. So back in the, like nineties, eighties, whatever, we were. You know what I mean? When we had analog phones and stuff, you know, Africa really didn't have too much landline phones. Mm -hmm. I mean, you they out in deserts and in 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 the safari, whatever. But there's no landlines out there. Or once you got to like the major cities, of course they had landlines. But most of the people didn't have landlines. But all of a sudden, they leapfrog past the landline, and everybody just popped up with cell phones. Like, yo, 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 what's up? They walking around, switching switching out SIM cards and right. stuff, and popping SIM cards left and right. But now. They're, they're, but Africa's money is, is so terrible that they don't even trade real fiat money. They use minutes cards. You know what I mean? They use, they trade minutes. You know what I mean? Using that as like, I bought two thousand minutes. I go to the store and grow, buy groceries with my minutes. Mm. So now they're actually gonna leapfrog the banking system. Does that make sense? Because like I said, there's no banks out in the, you out in the desert with some lions. You don't see no bank. You see a couple of huts, maybe. You know, you see, uh, <laughs> but you're not gonna see. No, I'm just saying, there's no banks out though. Yeah, that's they don't reaching, have the uh, technology. Yeah, yeah they're to, not gonna. Yeah, there's. Yeah, I might about, have to travel. No, no, I'm just saying. Uh, I'm sorry, Africa. I love you. Know, but all I'm trying to say is they're petty, petty, in those in those royal. If you know those, LJ, you know he petty. No, but <laughs> no, nah, if you're in those royal areas, though, I'm just saying there's no there's no banking system. So for me to go to the bank, I have to now go, you know what I mean, miles and miles and miles and miles to just get the bank and just get some dollars. Now, guess what? They're going to leapfrog that and go straight to crypto. Mm -hmm. So meaning now, if I'm in the middle of somewhere and I'm, hey, how much is those, those uh, bamboo things right there? I just want, oh, I can just send you some boop, XRP and there you go. Thank you. I'm on my way. I don't have to be like, yo, you know what? I like that, but I don't have no money on me. You want it? You know, I got to go too. Everything will be done. You know what I mean? 
And Africa, once again, is one of those big leapfrog countries that's just so, going to leap, leapfrog right into so cryptocurrency. So are, are we assuming that everybody in Africa has cell phones? Oh, I know everybody in Africa has cell phones. Oh, okay. Ask them. They'll tell you everybody. <laughs> they got cell phones. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just asking. asking. Hey, hey, don't, that's one thing they got. They got cell phones. Right, they got right. two or three of them. Right. Hey, they, right. they got cell phones, and they got minutes. Hey, hey. I'll tell you, is. Africa out here. It is, man. V-Chain, you know, supply chain blockchain management um you know it's definitely taking over the support uh support for supply chain industry um we definitely advocate for v chain here on maryland for crypto yeah, yeah v chain all day yeah definitely. definitely um so let's uh let's keep it rolling guys um you know like i said there's a lot of things happening in the crypto space right now um you know what what are some because you know we're, we're here to teach we're here to educate you mm -hmm. know what are some things that you know we feel that people should do that you know the market has seen a retracement you know what's the state of the bull market right now um you know where do we think it's going things of that nature because we want to make sure our viewers are well informed and that they know you know so v chain wise v chain yeah, yeah. wise um, i mean well i mean since we on the topic of v chain let's, let's tie you in i mean once again things in the market with v chain i mean i know a lot of these like partnerships that we talked about that actually partnerships that we have not talked about will be coming on board mm -hmm. in the next month like literally march april may because usually v chains process when they bring in a new company and when they got to go through the whole process of finding out their niche and what they need to build their their platform for mm -hmm. it takes about seven to eight months for them to correlate all that and get everything together and get it out and pushing out to the company right. so you gotta think with covid last year a lot of stuff was pushed back yeah you know definitely. what i mean a lot of things were put on hold a lot of things were put on the shelf c word. yep oh yeah i'm sorry with, with the c word so the those -word. yeah the c word so a lot of those partnerships are now are, are are jumping out the box now they're gonna come in they're coming on board in march april so a lot of veto uh veto burn and uh v vet should be jumping up and coming up soon Hmm. I'm not a financial advisor, folks. I'm just doing my research. Definitely, definitely. Fact. So uh, you heard it here first. So Joyce, yeah. what do you think? Are you, are you holding? Are you, you some are you hodling? Are you hodling V chain? I am. You're hodling yeah. V chain for the long haul. <laughs> yeah. Okay, as you should, as you should. Yeah. Right. We we all. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. definitely. V chain will be. Listen, I have V chain. I'm not gonna give you that prediction. I'm gonna I'm wait. No, go, come oh, on. Yeah. No, we yeah. want to hear. Can't, what, you can't what, just. I can't. I can't. What, what, you can't what, just because uh, you know, I mean, I, you know, everybody gets their information from somewhere. Mm -hmm. So, right. so what predictions do you have going on with uh, V Chain? Like, no, tell me. First, I, I want to see what your prediction is. What, what do you feel first? For me, uh, I, I mean, you know what I feel. Well, what's you your hope? What I feel. What do you I feel hope? like we should get this to the people after the break because this is real deal <laughs> information, <laughs> and they, I, I think we should drop <laughs> this on look, them listen, after listen, this commercial listen, break that we're about to uh, jump into. Man. So that's a bet. That's that's a we bet. can do so, that. Yeah, let's let's bring it back because you know we gotta make sure y'all still watching. Four cent. Yes. So it's four cent coming back. We're going to give our prediction. That's what it is. That's what, yeah, we're, that's that's what, we that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. All right. Maryland for Crypto Show. That's how we do it. We'll be right back. After Coming back to break. you, folks. Bye, bye, bye. by the few, the powerful, and the greedy. We should be free, free to choose, to trade, to create. It is time for a new world. A world founded on safety and security. A world where everything you do creates power. Power for all. And you. You will.
will decide the shape of this world. The power to change the future is in your hands. Test. I'm hot. What up? What up? What up? Welcome back. Welcome we back. back. Bop, bop, bop. Maryland for Crypto Show. It's your boy Sean Prince. I got my guy LJ in the building. My guy Money Meach. What it and do? our very first special guest to the Maryland for Crypto Show, Joyce Vamja. Mm -hmm. Thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us once again. And um, yeah, man, you know, we I feel like we touched bases on a lot of topics today, especially as it pertains to VeChain, one of the only and one of the best blockchain supply chain management right. coins in the arena right now. Yeah. And let's um, get back to Joyce. Though. Let's uh, yeah, let's hear let's hear yeah. a little bit from Joyce. You know, if you got any you know questions, anything you want to say to the people, anything you want to ask us, you know, this is why we're here. We'll thank you. We're glad you're here. Yeah. So you know, let's we want know. that smoke, Joyce. Yeah, ask so us what, what you got going we on. We want for your us, best Joyce. hitters right give now. Us, give let's us all that. What, give what, us all that free smoke. What we yeah. could do. <laughs> give us that know? free smoke. <laughs> yeah, I do have a couple questions. Uh, my first one is in the background. How how do we get this technology out so it's used in public? I mean, do you want to go first? Uh, no, nah, bro, take it away. Uh, take mean, it away. Take it away. How? First of all, how do we get this technology out? That's the question. To like the to the like to, to a global standpoint yeah. or to a, yeah. okay. So it's used well, first of all, well, first of all, it's being used already in on China. the Eastern Hemisphere. Yeah. So first of all, right. America just has to stop playing around with these regulations, and we just have to get solid regulations that we can use. Yeah. Because once again. Institutions don't want to come into the game if they don't know what rules they plan by. Right. You know what I mean? We, they want to play a game, but if they don't know rules, they just don't like. Well, well, what's the rules of this game? Well, what's the point of us playing? Mm -hmm. Like, how, if if I do something wrong, are you going to come back and sue me later? Are you going? Is the SEC going to be trying to look for me later? Mm -hmm. So I'm not even going to jump into this space mm -hmm. until I get true regulation. So Facts. that's one thing. Um, getting true clarity, regulatory clarity on this space will definitely help bring adoption in. Then you have to have um, hospitals like John Hopkins, number one hospital in the world, ladies and gentlemen. And if John Hopkins takes this in, it adopts this type technology, it's over. It's over. And it's already adopted then, in Cyprus. And so. then you have you have uh, um, Maryland, you know, University of Maryland, shock trauma, number one shock trauma place in the world, pretty much in Maryland. So if they adopt this, what what is it? It's over. over. <laughs> it's over. over so those things like that to get that spikes but once again we're just talking medical spikes field. we're talking medical field right now right because if like i said it's a Big supply partners. it's really a supply chain industry so right once nike like i said all these other walmart of america nike's that, on board yeah, walmart's on board yeah adidas mm -hmm. but then once again they're on board outside of the united states right right, right. They, you know right let's be clear nike's in oregon yeah so right. once that v chain comes to oregon oh it's, mm -hmm. oh, it's mm -hmm. a wrap you right 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 you know right. what i mean right like, under armor is in um Maryland. Mm -hmm. So once that comes to Maryland, Maryland for crypto. yep, Maryland for crypto, baby. All, once again, all these all these uh, places are in Maryland. John Hopkins, shout University out to of Maryland. Under Armour. Yep, shout out to Under Armour. Well, once again, all these places though are here. So once V Chain comes to America and able to capture this United States um, market, it, it is a wrap. Yeah, that's that's all we're waiting for. Yeah, definitely. We have the power, and they're just waiting. Now, don't get me wrong. China, I mean, they, but I don't, actually, I, I'm, I take that back. They don't need us. China itself can carry V chain. China, like the United States, has about three hundred and what fifty million people all together. Okay. Let's mm -hmm. give them the scale. Real yeah, quick yeah. So China has scale. what one point something two point billion people in the, in in their country. Right. So they, honestly, V chain don't need to come to the United States. Like really they can doesn't. trump us right. and without the United States at all. Like right. So. Just, they just want our market because, of course, we have the, it's, it's glam and, and glimmer yeah, over here. It's, it's like going to Vegas. It's, right it's known to history that yeah. America has the money. Right, we're entertainment. Yeah. You know, like, we, yeah. we entertain the whole Facts. world. So to yeah. bring that over here to, to them, know. United States is like Hollywood. Like if yeah. we can make it to Hollywood, we make it to we United States. Anywhere. We, we can global, make it anywhere. Baby. We global, Basically. but they don't need us. They don't really. I mean, yeah. V Chain can prosper outside of the United States and keep going. And move just as great. And as a matter of fact, the United States will be wishing we had VeChain. Facts. Yeah. Facts. So, yeah, Facts. definitely. Just to kind of, you know, keep it rolling security. and mm -hmm. piggyback off of what she said. I just really think, you know, it's going to, time will help bring it to the public. Um, 
I think once people, you know, see that this uh, supply chain is proven and that, you know, it's able to deliver on what is being asked upon it, I think like that will help with mass adoption and bringing it to the public, you know, kind of. Um, and once we keep keep rolling with these government contracts and things mm -hmm. of that nature, I think it'll definitely, you know, be be able to uh, be a part of everyday life very soon. Right. Um, what else you got for us, Joe? Yeah. So, um, yeah. My Any last question mm -hmm. is um, once cryptocurrency becomes standard, what's going to happen to the national debt? Oh, that's a good question, Joyce. Ooh, that's that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a little question. bit of a deep dive right there. Oh, I don't know. That's VIP, man. Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> no, you me. know, give, it, that, give your opinion. It's opinion. So, what do you think? I, I you know, my National opinion. Uh, there's a lot of uh, knowing all the money's been produced pretty much in the past year over. What, over, what they printed over sixty trillion dollars or something. Something for the, something yeah, along those lines. Yeah, yeah there's like we're, yeah. we're in about thirty-five trillion. Listen, in one year though. Like Listen. the the world's most of the world's money has been printed this year. Right. I mean, you know, it's er, 2020. Sorry. It's said that, you know, the Fed is you know what's really running everything, right? Right. So um, the Fed got their money in everybody's pocket. You no, know, honestly, um, that's that's a little bit out of my league. I'm if I'm being honest, you know, I'm not going. I, mean, I look, I'm a, I'm a straight up dude. Anybody who knows me, you know that I'm gonna give it to you raw. You know, I ain't gonna make nothing up. I don't look if I don't know Real something. I, I look, I can't. I couldn't answer that question for you. I don't well, know what they're gonna do with all this. I thing. mean, I'm gonna take a quick little stab. At yeah, me. you I mean, look. You know what I mean. My, I, you my OG. Yeah. So I mean, by all means, I'm a <laughs> drop this knowledge on all, all means. I'm not, I'm I'm look, not it's out of my league, right there. And this is just my opinion, folks. But like I said, the world debt. All right, when crypto right now, first of all, we want we've been printing more than the world's money in the past year and a half. So the world debt is already going to a certain point. Mm -hmm. And so with cryptocurrency, AKA the, the the great reset, I think with cryptocurrency is giving us that hedge to reset ourselves in a digital world. So mm -hmm. now, yeah, we're in debt fiat, you know what I mean, with physical money, right? but we're not in debt with, with actual crypto money. Right. Like right now, we're ahead of the game. We're so we're thinking you know, it might be swept so, under the rug. Yeah, I mean, what what me personally, I mean, I can get deep, 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 but I think they're literally trying to bankrupt the United States, bankrupt the countries to actually hedge yourself and go that's into crypto. So point. almost like a reset. Yeah, there's a reset. That's, yeah, I mean, global reset. That's I mean, that's what I've been seeing, reading for the past two years now. I mean, the great reset here, the great reset. You know, there. I can I, like I you know, think about with, it. It's with, kind of already in motion. Yeah, it's, right? it's, with, it's with, in motion. With, with, with everything, with everything going on with the C word, mm -hmm. you know, uh, you know our our you know global economy, economy, you know, as far as U.S. it's 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 took a stop. Mm -hmm. So you know, while you know. U.S. was the leaders of the world, right? Uh, you know, world currency. and and then you have a uh, yeah, there was leaders of the world currency, and then you have you uh, China, which is you know you know kind of right behind them, you know, kind of slowly working their way up. But as you know, with the whole pandemic that's going on and everything, um, Asian companies have, I mean, Asian countries have begin to move forward. I don't know if I said that correctly. I'm, I no, I get what you're saying. But, yeah, no. but yeah, they they've continued to move forward and yeah, thrive. Moving at so, so you right know, now. while we're sitting here stagnant, you know, not at producing right, not producing the amount of money that we are used to producing. Right, you know, small yearly. businesses are closed. Yeah. Exactly. Um, you know exactly sales are closed, things of that nature. You know, China is slowly rising. Pretty slowly good. rising, you know. Because they're already digitized. Right. Exactly. Think exactly. Of, yeah. Think of the United States as you saying both. Yeah, to to pass him in a race, well, you got you got to hope something happens to him, right? You gotta, right. Hopefully, he hurts the ankle, hurts the toe. He he pulls a hamstring just right. to catch up to him. Because you're not beating him. You're not beating him. Up. So that's how the United States is right now. To Unless to have other countries catch up to us financial wise, you know what I mean, industry wise and technology wise, they had to slow us down some type of way. Like I said, us moving at full capacity, 100 percent, nobody's gonna catch America. Facts. You you slow Facts. us down. You put us at twenty five percent capacity and across the world. Guess what? We moving at twenty five percent. China has been moving at one hundred percent since what? Since September, right? And yeah. they started it supposedly. So right. I mean, they've been back. They up. They just matter of fact. They just had Chinese New Year. Not trying to say they can't have their New Year, but they just they partying like it's nineteen ninety nine over there. Yep. You know. <laughs> and if anybody knows, the Chinese New Year is like Thanksgiving. It's like New Year's. It's like uh, Christmas. And and New Year's Eve all wrapped in one in a two week span. 
Right. So they over there partying like nothing's happening. I was watching the videos, live stream, they part. I don't see them wearing no masks. <laughs> no masks. I'm like, Jesus. They 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 in crowds. I mean people they they look like New Year's here. Uh, in New York, and they out in the middle of the street for two weeks, no masks on, but they good. But we still at 25% capacity. We still can't open up. So yeah, back to the, the debt though. But I think this debt is definitely gonna get ran up to eventually crash the economy. And they're not really gonna crash it. They're just gonna segue over to crypto. It's yeah. gonna be a nice little, hey, they're gonna finesse us, you know what I'm saying? They're gonna be like, hey, why don't you come over here for a second? <laughs> <laughs> we got something nice over here. Because right. they're gonna start tossing us free money. You know, crypto, you get you get they're interest. Work us into it. Yeah, huh? they're gonna work. Slowly, but they're sure. gonna be like, oh yeah, Facebook, oh, you know, you can get some free crypto on Facebook eventually. Mm -hmm. you I, mean, know what I mean, we've been they're seeing gonna... a lot of historical things take yeah. place recently with um, especially with us receiving, you know, stimulus checks. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's right. hasn't mm -hmm. happened in the conception or in the history of the United States. Hey, right. I was so, about to say this is definitely it. hasn't happened in my Close lifetime. To socialism. I mean, we did get stem Obama. Hey, I got you, Obama. I said, you gave, I got my five hundred. I don't know what they was doing. <laughs> I got my five hundred back in the day. Hey, I needed that too. It came up big. Yeah, I definitely ain't get that. Obama hit us with the five hundred. I was like, oh. Yeah, definitely. So it's like you know, it's. I just feel like you know the the writing's already on the wall. Mm -hmm. So it's just about you know implementation, and it's about. Um, you know, not only mass adoptions with corporations, but with people as well, with the people that are, you know, going to be buying into these markets along with the big companies that are already buying in like Grayscale and Microsoft. Yeah. Um, some, you know, just to, you know, uh, bring back some V chain partners. We got we got Moet, we got Hennessy, oh, yeah. we got Sam's Club, we Adidas. got Walmart, Adidas. Mm -hmm. um, these are all big companies, you Sam's know, uh, hospital adoption, government adoption, things yeah. of that nature. Yeah. Um, with all these things happening in V chain, you know, just to bring it to our hospital price predictions, um, I, I personally think before this bull run cycle is over with mm -hmm. V chain having a $2.1 billion market cap mm -hmm. and having, let me, I always got to check my numbers, having about 703 million in volume circulation right now i personally i mean now you know price predictions is just a prediction so uh -huh. don't take that you yeah, know yeah. price prediction I mean, it's a price prediction but i heard him right i think prediction. i personally think you know with it being at three cents right now i think we can confidently say that with everything happening with v chain we'll reach at least a 50 to 60 percent 50 to 60 cents i think v chain will be before by the end of this bull run oh um, yeah, yeah definitely uh no question i can almost kind of guarantee that Oh, and I'm just going. We're going to stamp I that. Guarantee it. We can. We're going to stamp this that. Blue magic on Maryland for crypto <laughs> here today, yeah. March second. Yeah. Let's do it. You know, that's what I'm thinking. The price prediction is yeah. going to be. How about you know? How about my guys in the building? What y'all think V Chain is going to be at moving forward? Because you know, I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come in with a little deep dive for a quick second. Yeah, I guess that's, that's that's the OG. I, right I, there. You know, yeah. me. OG triple but, OG. But, no, no, I, so I, I, so I, me personally, know. me personally, you know, I'm gonna give a I'm gonna give a smaller, shorter, shorter span. In, you know, prediction. Mm. Where, where we're in, we're in March. It's March second today. Um, I think that uh, V Chain by the end of March will definitely be at least at ten cent. That's Ooh, a, ooh that's a heavy. Ooh, we're at heavy. Uh, well, we at three we're, four cents. No, right we're now. Four, yeah, we're at four. We're at four cent so right now. So pretty much, you saying if I put a thousand dollars right now, at four cent. If it get to ten cent. I'm going to double my money Don't. and some. And some. With an extra and two cent to spare. And some. That's what uh, you're saying. With the, with the recent retracement. We're not um, financial advisors, folks. You know, it, went up we to, it, it went up to six cent uh, with the recent retracement. It retraced back to three. It played it played a lot at the, you know, three and four cent, you know, line. Mm -hmm. So, I you the know, I feel like, average move. Yeah, Right. Yeah. So, I feel like it's creating a new foundation there. And I, you know, sh strongly feel that Unless, it will... Uh, Strive. It will. It will. It will I, I feel like it will rise to at least ten cent. By and the let's end of and March. let's be clear about you know V Chain in itself. From its conception, V Chain was less than a cent, half of a fraction. It was right. about a thousandth of a penny. Right. right. Seven thousandth yeah. of a penny. Yeah. And if you got in, when I now, got in. Yeah. 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 Uh, now, yeah. Like you know, <laughs> we've had yeah. a, a hundred and eighty percent growth rate of right. V Chain mm -hmm. from from its conception. So V Chain has already grown a hundred and eighty percent from where it's where when it was yeah. con when it came to be up to now. And here at Maryland for Crypto, we have seen a lot of gains from that growth rate. From that growth rate. Yes, sir. Because you know we were we were Invested. we we we've been doing this for a while. Yeah. You know, uh, not, I, I'm not going to say too long because, you know, we wasn't around for the 2017 bull run. No. You know, we're here now 
and we're going to keep on But we took climbing. advantage of that crash. Yeah, definitely. We're going <laughs> to keep on climbing. We definitely took advantage of that crash. We're going to keep on climbing. We got in before the beginning of this bull run. Right. So, you know, I, we're talking point zero zero five zero zero two. Yeah. You know, LJ, L, he, my, so, my guy so right here, Dread City, he, oh. he was in before well, me. He brought me into the game. Yeah, yeah. So, so let's, um you know, with Joyce being, yeah, you know, a newbie to the game, you know, I, I've always uh, liked to hear the term beginner's luck. Yeah. So let's hear, huh. let's hear, let's yeah. hear from Joyce. What do you think that price prediction is going to be, Joyce, for this, now, for this yeah. bull run? I mean, no, you we want to hear nurse practitioner. We want to hear the nurse you practitioner. You in the streets? You on the front line? What do you think? V chains about three cents right now. We, you a central we, worker? We, we're honestly thinking a bull run could last about till September. So you can you can give it up to a shorter range, a longer range. You know, where do you think the price of V chain is going to be with everything it's that we? It's March or the end of the year. Yeah. Uh, I said end of the month, end of the year, whatever uh, she wants no, to do. No, give us the end of the year then. We want to get the month might be too much for you right now because that's a strong prediction. But give us the end of the year. What do you think, V Chain, with all his partnerships? <laughs> oh, with all the partnerships. Well, I mean, it would really be a big guess for me. I have no, I have no idea how to even begin to try to answer that. But Just maybe guess. by September. Mm -hmm. 70, 80 cents. Oh, she, I like it. She said 70, 80 cents. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because like she's cause going I, for the gust. Hold on, look. Because oh, I want to know. I want to. No I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Is that just a random guess, or yes. is it's just a random guess? <laughs> yes. Okay, well, I, I'll, I'll take that. Opinion. I'll take that. It's hey, her opinion. It's her opinion. It's it's her opinion. opinion. But, but you, show. but you, do you see it truly growing there? Yeah, oh yeah, that's why I'm invested. So there. you believe okay. in there technology? You go. Okay, she believes yeah. in there. You go. That's, that's, that's what matters. That's, that's, exactly. that's what's important right there. That's what's important. That's what's important, man. You gotta look, look, find stuff that. If it gets there, Joyce, I'll I'll send you some of my VG. No, no, about this. Listen, it gets to seventy eight cents by. That's that good luck charm right there, guys. Right. Joyce, we all charm. going on vacation. Since you the OG, since she the first person on the show, we're right. gonna bring her on vacation. We 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 it's ain't sense, boy. We out here. If it get that, if it get the if it get the 70 cent, it get 80 cents. Listen, listen, if y'all following us right now, if y'all following us right now and y'all choose to, you know, you know, you know, take note. You know a little bit And what we're saying mm -hmm. And it goes to 70 cent Guess what We build it Our trusted community Right there We it build is. it Because we told Selling you money you, you, heard money 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 you heard it here first You heard it here first On the so, Maryland for crypto And, and I'm telling you right now If it goes to 70 cent You know that's That's I'm, we where we going? <laughs> Man, we going everywhere. What country we going? Uh, we, you might not see this show Brazil, no more. Hey, it gets to seven years. I love Brazil. Like, nah, don't, nah, love don't, let them, don't let them cap you out. Yeah, we nah, nah. we gonna have a show from Brazil. Oh, that's, yeah. what <laughs> that's what it's gonna be. Yeah, don't no, but Brazil. We gonna be in Europe. We gonna be in England somewhere. Yeah, we I'm gonna be here. with the kings and queens. <laughs> we royalty here. We royalty here. Mm -hmm. So what about you, LJ? Where you think V Chain is gonna be at by the end of this bull run? I mean, I, she already topped it. I can't even. I was she's looking. a hard follower. Yeah, she's a hard follower. <laughs> follow right I was going to say anywhere anywhere between 50 to 60 cents. At, 60 at his, cents okay. I mean, me, wishful thinking, I think within the next two, three years, it's going to be over a dollar, two dollars, period. Oh, man, oh, but, man. Music's in my ears. But let me, let me kind of just break down just why I think it could be that, though. All right, and just real fast. All right, once again, it's what, 80, 89 with billion uh, v chain in the world, right? Mm -hmm. Market cap right now is at two point one billion. Is it's it's, it's two one. Two point one. Are billion. you sure that's the market? I watched it this morning. I thought it was one point nine. I mean, it could be. It, it might have been one point nine. But listen, I just y'all know the market moving. Yeah, it's moving. So it could it's be one point nine this morning, whatever. That's, that's, but that's my cool. whole thing is, just if you let's just imagine right now, right? And this is a question though. People's asked me also too, mm -hmm. how much V chain you think you should have, right? Mm. So I just want to throw this little scenario out, right? Weird question. Yeah, so because I get it all the time, like yeah, LJ definitely. in the vet world. How much should you? How much invest? do? How much should I invest? How much do you think I should get? I mean, so me personally, I think first of all you should at least try to achieve at least a hundred thousand V chain, and now a hundred thousand V chain at this moment roughly is anywhere it's about four thousand to five thousand dollars, give or take, give or take, give, give or take, right? So you're telling me five thousand dollars, all right, investment, mm -hmm. all right, to Get a hundred thousand V chain. Now, mm. once again, if V chain gets to one dollar, guess how much dollars you have? You've had a hundred thousand dollars off off five thousand dollar investment. Hundred, hundred, hundred. So, so me personally, to see major gains. Now, everybody's pockets different. 
So I'm not trying to say you. That's right. the, the. If you get fifty, let's say you get fifty thousand, but off of you know what I mean, uh, two thousand dollar, uh, you know what I mean, investment. investment. That's still great gains. But me personally, if you're striving, you want to see life changing. Like, hey, I can actually put that down payment on a house type of thing and exactly. move my family from a different. Mm-hmm. I would say at least choose one about one hundred k, and. Now back to the, the the market cap though. Once so, if you do the numbers right, so market cap like I said, one point nine. Mm. All right, and let's say V Chain does a ten percent off of that or ten times itself off of that, right? That puts the the market cap at about nineteen billion dollars. Right. Right. So that puts V Chain about thirty cents right there. Oh. So at thirty cents and you have a hundred thousand, that means you about got a hundred thousand dollars just off right. of about five thousand dollar investment right there. Investment. Mm-hmm. All right. Absolutely. Now you're gonna come back. You're gonna get some retracements and stuff on that. Absolutely. Right. But at the same time, now if you take that same thirty cents, right after we kind of hovered around, and you times that within the next year, or so in like 2022, uh, 22, by another ten, you know, I mean ten times itself, that puts the market cap now about a hundred and ninety nine. Trying to do it off the top of my head, like one ninety, almost two hundred thousand, two hundred billion as a market cap. Now you have a, a market cap of. But once again, two hundred billion and V chain should probably be around three dollars and sixty something cents. Oh, okay. Give it that. Yeah. So once again, if you have a hundred K and times about three dollars and fifty cent or sixty cent, that's close to about four hundred thousand dollars that you got. Right. That's life changing. Man. So me personally, if you have the bread, if you can I'm not saying I'm once again, I'm not a financial advisor. Right. This is right. just me being in my master's program and my finance program and me doing and my own diligence. research and my calculations on my calculator every night when I'm here like oh I need this to, yeah I'm doing all my same calculations but, but just know that would be what I would aim for now some of us over here already got that in a couple I mean but at the same time like I said if you're, if you're average but I would say look, that's what you need to man, go man look I ain't here to talk about my bag and how full it is. <laughs> I, that, that ain't what I came it's here for. Here, North yeah, North. That, look, that's not what I came here for. No but ain't for how, how much? How much V chain should you have? You should have as much as you can have. Period. There Period. It is. It's you know in the simplest form, you should have as much as you can have. You know, don't hurt yourself. Don't the five thousand is doable. Don't go break rub. Don't you know, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah, we're not know, saying don't, don't don't pay your bills. Yeah, folks. pay your pay your bills. <laughs> Feed you your know kids, what I'm all right. But, but five thousand dollars is, is doable. A lot right. of as much ballers as people out here stunting with chains and you pulling up with Royce Royces and everything else. You got five stacks. You, right. you, you invest it. it. Don't go spend it on the next Jays. Invest it. Mm-hmm. Invest it. You know what I mean? Double Muscle it, up. Triple it. Just know. Invest hold, it. Invest it. Hold for a year or two and come back. You're going to be sitting right. And that's really what we are here for. Yeah. We're here to just bring awareness to the right. the investment game. Yeah, you didn't or the know the crypto numbers game. You know, just, we, we, just we, calculating off the top of the head. Right. We, I mean, look, we we hustling over here. That's yeah. that's all it is. It's, crypto hustle. It's a new hustle that we found, and it's a legal hustle. Right. So why not get and, with it? And it's a future hustle. It's not even a Le- hustle. It's coming. Legal future hustle. <laughs> right. Ahead of the curve. Ahead of the curve. So, you know, you can take... You can take that however you want to. Mm. I, obviously, everybody isn't going to believe the process of the growth of the technology. Right. They're not. However, this is what is happening. Caucasians do. You know, they they invest. They do research. Right. They 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 understand the game. Yeah. And they get in the game. Right. It takes money to make money. We've right. heard it all our lives. Right. We've heard it all our lives. All our lives. But how much do we really buy into that? And yeah, invest. Right. And what people don't understand, we're early. These are cents on a dollar. V chain. We're, we're not saying go and invest in Amazon when it's like three thousand dollars. V chain is three cents. Three cents. I got three cents in my pocket right now. It's three cents. Buy some. <laughs> <laughs> like four literally, cents, literally. You like can, a you nickel can, you gets put, you one. You can put fifty dollars, which could be a dollar in a year. So a nickel will get you ninety-five cents more in Listen. a year if you hold it. Like Listen. you can't beat that. Like man, man. yeah, definitely, it's definitely. Like, and um, I, I definitely agree. Five thousands, you know. Um, <laughs> Yeah, it's just what what good investors do. You know, all right. people, all races, all creeds. You know, as long as you you you're well rounded and you got your head in the right place, mm-hmm. you need to invest in V Chain. I mean, VeChain is just about sustainability, anti-counterfeiting, and I think um, it will build confidence in its consumers in the long run and will one day integrate global integration. 
Right. Period. Um, definitely. And um, so just to, uh, you know, before we wrap it up, man, um, you know, I think viewers should definitely keep V-Chain on their radar. Mm -hmm. It should be something that should definitely be in your portfolio, whether you're a beginner or you're, you know, been in the space for a little while. Right. And, um, yeah, just to, uh, you know, let's let's end it on a light note. You know, let's talk about who got wrecked this week, man. Because somebody every week always is getting always wrecked. Always get wrecked. Um, I don't know. I feel like... Just Twitch a lot of eyes. A week, lot of eyes being I, Eli Musk. It, 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 <laughs> yeah, I personally think my guy Peter Skiff okay. got wrecked. Him and Elon got into a little bit of a Twitter battle um, okay. here recently. Wait, wait, and, but uh, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Before you finish, who is Peter Skiff? Peter Skiff is. Um, I would definitely say he's in the tax space. He's um, you know made a lot of major investments, but mm -hmm. he's okay. against cryptocurrency. Anybody, right. um, not anybody, but most people would just know if him. You know, as you a, know as a well-informed investor right? okay and um yeah so he's definitely is not an advocate for the crystal space at all mm -hmm. and um a lot of things if he he said he's pretty much had to stuff his foot in his mouth because a lot of things he said that's not going to happen has already transpired is that the one that got the tattoo of the moon and all that stuff i don't think that's he him. lost uh, i don't think that's him I that might but uh, i just thought it was funny no, uh, no, he Peter, lost the bet. Peter, I, want, I think it's Peter. i think it is he Peter. might he might it might be that guy i don't know so but i do know big... that he uh he he predicted that uh, well not he predicted but he Elon Musk was the richest man in the world about a week or two ago right it's all because good of a week his ago. Uh, <laughs> his Bitcoin investment and how Bitcoin rolls but when right. Bitcoin took that spike recently he took a spike Elon right? took a spike yeah yeah right? pretty much putting him in like third place right and Peter Skiff went on on his uh, his tirade about how Elon is just pretty much an idiot. Oh and my gosh! Elon responded to the guy with an I'm eggplant. an idiot for being the third richest <laughs> man in the world. Right. He right. responded. I want to be the, the idiot. I want to be the dumbest person in the world. To right. Shoot. Let me be the idiot. I'm the third richest person. Right. So yeah, Peter Skiff, you got wrecked, man. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's right. either get with the crypto or keep it rolling. Yeah, you yeah. know, He must be a baby boomer. I'm gonna <laughs> just leave it at that. So, you know, <laughs> man. Peter Skiff got wrecked, but yeah, just uh, so final takeaways, definitely, people, you know, um. V chain definitely su blockchain supply chain supply Man. chain management, you know definitely want to get on board with the V chain fellas. Uh, we got any final takeaways we want to give to the people? You know, yeah. follow us Maryland for Crypto Show. I got I got one little last thing. Hey, if you're not on NFTs, something's wrong out there. And NFTs. them worlds NFTs non fungible NFTs. tokens. Hey, visual art out there. People are getting money out there. Big hey, money. Big money. Hey, if you're an artist, definitely. Hey. Look into NFTs, ladies and gentlemen. Search People it. Are, Google it. Yeah, I saw an NFT it. recently that sold for 300 Ethereum, and it was literally... 300 a, Ethereum. It was literally <laughs> a cat, like, flying on a rainbow. Flying on a rainbow. And I'm, you got I'm, sold for I'm gonna do that. I'm going to do that Let's math. Let's do the math yeah. and see yeah. how much Real that... Quick. That Real was quick. about, like, what, like seven? Uh, you like probably... A, it's an iPhone, so you probably... 300 Ethereum uh, right now is it's about fifteen. dollars yep. yep. yeah. Yeah. 300. We're going to do that times... Let's just do three hundred. Let's just do fifteen hundred. That's four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Off a of, off of a picture a, of a cat on a, a rainbow. Meme. It was literally like it looked like a meme. It was a it was a it is a meme. meme. It's a it's and visual art for three hundred to thirty. Jabray can make. My daughter can make that. She's four. <laughs> so, yeah. It's a, it's sold for four hundred thousand dollars. Hey Jabray, we in the studio. <laughs> Even though it's a brand new space, it's sometimes not we the most the space. Don't worry, I got you, I don't baby. See why anybody home. would buy that for that amount of money? But hey, if you got it, why not flaunt it, right? People right. are buying it. Yeah, hey, that, that, hey, if you, it ain't tricking if you got it, right? Yeah, damn, I, I, you damn, know, damn. I, I heard that all my life too. NFTs is that's, out here. That's a real thing. Man, fact, we want to do a show on NFTs because people's out here. I can't believe they selling digital art for four hundred thousand dollars of a picture of a cat. Bro. And that's not even it. I saw one dude just got a little cigarette in his mouth with a little digital art with a little cigarette smoke. That sold for like is is what they call the uh, cypherpunks or yeah. or something like that. That sold for something crazy two hundred three hundred thousand dollars. Right. Look, that's it's crazy, man. It's it's it, it get deep, man. Look, we yeah. could we could sit here and talk about domain names domain. and how they get sold. Oh yeah, <laughs> unstoppable name. Look, shout out to the digital investor. Yeah, right. You know, well, you but, know what? Yeah. You know. We're going we're gonna to wrap it up here on the Maryland for Crypto Show today. I want to give a big thank you and a big shout out to Joyce Bombshell for joining yeah, us yeah, here yeah. today. We appreciate thank you for coming out for sure. Our first sure. guest, first of many. I got, and, um, I got one last shout out. Definitely. Though. OG definitely. Yeah, you know, we're going to shout out everybody. You know, hey. Studio 202, Maryland mm -hmm. for Crypto. I'm your boy, Sean Prince in the building. 
I got my guy LJ. He want to show some love to yeah, some yeah, of the yeah. folks on our live that's watching show right now. Show some love to the live. But actually, I want to show some love to our YouTubers, the people that we follow sometimes here and there. You know what I mean? To get some of our v stats. Because that's Definitely. the thing. It's about waking people up. So, right. once again, I want to shout out to our main man because he shouts us out all the time, every day. Satoshi, Satoshi Booming. Yes, Satoshi sir. Booming. On the track. V Chain. Yep. Shouts us out every day. Get a lot of you, information from that guy. A lot of information for so Very well rounded. We got also we got Eisenreich. He is the man. He's on like every. These are on Twitter people. Yeah. And um, Eisenreich, he's on almost every V Chain article like that. Literally before yep. I can even find it, he's already put his stamp on it and is on Twitter with his information. Yes. So he's big. Um, v Chain Thor community. Yep. Um, that's a big thing. If you're on Twitter or uh, YouTube, the big Ron Dalton. Once again, these are V Chain people. Once again, that we follow on Twitter to help get our information, yep. and they're, yep. they're, they're 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 lifesavers. Like we can't do our job without them doing their job. Yes, sir. We and are. Last one. Last one. Cryptocurrency news. YouTube. Definitely, I watch a lot of those 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 channels, mm -hmm. and we deep dive and and, and follow those people, and definitely. So shout out to them if you're trying to get feed chain and wonder about where I can do my research at. Those yep. are the people once again. Yep. Also, mm -hmm. um, don't forget uh, Crypto Teacher. He's a good, you know, guy. Oh uh, yeah, Crypto he Teacher. He brings a lot of informative information. Uh, you know, check him out. Like we say, you know, we get our information from, you know, the, you know, information circles. We are in the age of information. Yeah. So take advantage of it. Man, it's we literally there in front of your face. YouTube University. You yeah, know, yep, yep. YouTube great, University, man. Twitter for University, for you know real. what I mean? Google University, <laughs> right? Google University, <laughs> Coin we, Market Cap University. <laughs> right. You want to drop any of your stuff, Facebook bro. names, anything out there for the people to follow you, or anything yeah. like that? Oh, I mean, I'm just Joyce Vomsher. Joyce Vomsher, <laughs> find her on Facebook. <laughs> Joyce Vomsher, shout your uh, shout your your handles. Joyce Bomb John Facebook. What you got? Twitter. You got Instagram. I do. I don't remember the name. Oh, <laughs> wrong with that. Uh, she is not she, active. Hey, listen, she, 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 ladies she's, and gentlemen, she's, she's, she's an essential front front worker. Yeah, yeah, she's, she's in the front, front line. She's not line. able. She don't right got there. time for she social, time media. social media. Right. She's, she's trying to save your life. Your exactly. cool. Your she's doing life. real life stuff. She deals with real life situations day in and day out. That V chain will help her solve. There it is. <laughs> hey, I think right. as that's the best way to end the show. <laughs> <laughs> Man, the crypto show. Hey, we'll catch y'all next week. We appreciate y'all, man. We appreciate you next Take, Tuesday. Thank live you, family. Yep. No, Every sir. Tuesday. We're going to be here. Yep, yep. We out. <laughs>